Hey, what's up everybody? Uh, this is Joe with uh, Pile Productions again. And uh, just wanted to highlight another bit of uh, stuff that we've put on our van for all of our adventures and uh, taking our clients out into the wild for photographs. So, uh, you know, without further ado, let's get to it. The, uh, you can't see it from here. It's up underneath, so I'm gonna reposition the camera and uh, we'll get started. Now, the first bit that I wanted to talk about is this. It's black, so you can't see it too good, but it is a, a 3 8 inch skid plate from Van Compass that goes on the front of the motor uh, up underneath here. And um, I put these on mostly just because I knew that I would be banging into stuff and running over rocks and gravel and high centering and stuff like that. So this thing is super bomber. Um, bolted on with these huge half inch bolts, snugged up, super tight. I would highly recommend checking these guys out if you're gonna do any off-roading in your Sprinter van. This is all one plate as well. It's aluminum, also by Van Compass. Bolts on to your original stuff up underneath here. And uh, also protecting all the motor bits and all that kind of stuff. Ours is actually really dirty right now. Uh, just because I haven't cleaned it since we got back from Moab. Okay. Now this one is the last one in line. They all bolt together. And uh, as you can see, I mean, it's pretty filthy. But it's got scratches on it already because I've, uh, I've high centered this thing a couple of different times. Uh, just driving along. But uh, you can, I mean, you can like raise the van with this thing. Um, and, and it's all like bolted into the frame of the van, so you're not gonna really, <laughs> you can't hurt this thing. And uh, I'm super excited to have these on here because it's like a, just another added feature to protect the underside. Because I saw this without these things and I was like, man, this thing is fragile. There's like wires and uh, cables and hoses and stuff just hanging out. So uh, definitely wanted to get some things up under here. Now this guy also bolts on and uh, it's got big giant U-bolts that go up over the side of the uh, the axle and then bolts on with a big another one another big U-bolt right here and uh, it's also got some scratches on it I'm seeing. Alright the casing to the back of this differential comes down and it actually hangs lower than the uh, differential itself. So. A lot of mechanics don't know that and they'll put the, the jack right onto here and push it up and it'll bend this flimsy piece of metal that's the seal and then you'll have a leak and you have to replace this and all that crap and you don't want to have to do that. You want to just be able to, you know, jack this thing up and use it, change stuff, whatever you've got to do. So anyway, those are the four bits that I've put on here from Van Compass. Um, again. I would, uh, you know, highly recommend using their stuff. They've got it dialed. Like all the bolts just go right in. They fit perfectly, um, and it's it's pretty seamless. So, I mean, it does take some time, and you have to like be a bit careful. But once it's on, it's like completely solid. So, yeah, check them out. VanCompass.com. Any Sprinter parts that you would need that they've. Uh, you know they've got them. They're uh, they're springs and all that kind of stuff that we've also put on. I'll highlight that in another video. But um, yeah, really happy with uh, not only their products, but their customer service is great too. So uh, yeah, really good people. They get right back to you, and they have a lot of uh, information and a lot of instructional videos online. So yeah, check them out. VanCompass.com. All right. Well. Uh, I'm just gonna hang out up underneath the van here for a minute. But uh, you guys have a good day, and uh, if you've made it this far into the video, then uh, please like and subscribe to the channel. And uh, thank you so much, I really do appreciate it. So uh, we'll talk to you soon. Cheers.